Good morning, everybody. We are Tuesday. Day 35 is in the books. I weighed myself this morning. Uh, I am at 333.2. So yesterday, I wasn't sure what, if I was 3.2 or 0.4. Uh, I looked up my app because you can see the, the history, and I was actually at 0.4. Today, I'm at 0.2. So I'm only down 0.2 pounds, but I had a fantastic day. So I ate very well. Um, not only did I eat well, but it was very satisfying. The, the amount of food that I ate. Uh, well, let me explain. Skip breakfast, right? As usual. Uh, for lunch, I had I had my shake. Um, I had some grapes. I did have more grapes than usually uh, than usual. Normally, I have a little cup. I probably had about three cups worth of grapes yesterday that I kind of ate during the day. So I probably started eating them around 11 a.m. all the way up to about 3 p.m. I just had them on my desk, so I would just pick through it, and it was it was good. It just kept me full all day. Uh, for dinner. Uh, we had pork chops, but like a really thick pork chop like this. And I ate about three quarters of that. We had a baked potato. I did put some butter on my baked uh, potato. Not much, just a little bit of butter. And uh, we had a little salad. That's it. That's it. And I wasn't hungry. I didn't crave anything. Things were good. So I, I have, even though I've lost, I, I'll be honest with you. I thought this morning I would have lost a lot more than 0.2 pounds. Um, because things are starting to come back out again. I'm starting to, uh, my water is starting to come back out. So I thought maybe I was out of, gone with the salt. I guess I'm not quite there yet. Uh, but I remember the last time this happened was uh, on my 30th. Actually, not too long ago, right? Like a week ago. I remember I weighed in, had lost a lot of weight one day. Uh, the next day I put on like a pound and a half or a pound. And then the day after I put on another half a pound. I'm like, what's going on? I remember. So uh, this time, at least I'm going back down. So I think it was a really good day. And that's why I'm not going up a second time like last time. Um, so yeah, now, uh, as you guys know, I'm kind of bummed out for my shakes. <laughs> um, I like them. I like them. And I only have one left. I thought that was yeah, I thought like yesterday was the last one, but I do have one more left in the fridge. Um, I didn't bring it today, simply because I will be on the road. Uh, tomorrow night, but more importantly, the day after for lunch, I'm going to be at this hotel. I don't know what they're going to have, so I don't want a chance. I want to keep it for that in case um, it's just not good for me with the food they have. So today, uh, I don't have any any alternatives. I don't have anything planned for lunch. I'll have to go downstairs and figure something out. Uh, listen, it's, 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 I've done well so far, so I'll, I'll figure something out. I might have a little bit more calories than I usually would since it's not going to be a 150-calorie meal, obviously, I'm going to have for lunch. Uh, but yeah, that's it. So yesterday, actually this morning, I woke up and I actually had a dream about losing weight. This is very odd to me. I don't, I don't dream very much, and when I do, I forget about it two seconds after I wake up. But this kind of stuck in my head, and I thought I'd share it. I actually... I don't, I don't remember what the dream was all about, but I remember walking in front of a mirror at one point and my stomach was flat. Very odd. Uh, and I wasn't skinny, but my stomach was fat. It was no longer, I didn't have the hanging that I have now. If I have to put a weight on it, I'd probably say it was probably somewhere around 230. So I had the flat stomach, the pecs were sticking out a little bit more and tucked in my pants kind of thing. It was, it was a very odd dream, but it, it felt, it just made it better when I woke up in the morning kind of thing. It started me off on the, on the right foot. Uh, I could sort of like envision what I'm, so I guess it just goes to show that it's, it's on my mind quite a bit these days to the point where I actually have a dream about it. Um, so that's about it. Let's see, anything else I to add today? It's a busy day for me, so I'm, I haven't put a lot of thought into this. Just kind of found a couple minutes, getting it done fast before I move on to my next meeting. Um, yeah, so to, as I, I say today, it's a lot of prepping to leave tomorrow to go uh, on my work trip. Uh, I have no planning at all. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I want to say this. So as you guys know, I, my shakes, I, I love them. And I, they don't, the, the shelves are empty everywhere. And I can't find them anywhere online. Uh, not easily anyways. So uh, I actually have some family members. My, uh, my wife was gone to the store. She looked. They didn't have any. Uh, my mom apparently went to a different store just in case for me uh, and they didn't have any and they told her that they were not restocking that that was the last of it and that's all they were getting i was bummed out so i looked up the uh the company that makes it and actually it's coca-cola it's a coca-cola product i had no idea 
but whenever you go on their, on their page for the product and you go to the contacts and eventually you see the email is a coca-cola email so i reached out to them and i told them that i was a big fan i asked if there's a way that i can get it elsewhere and we went back and forth a little bit but ultimately uh they they told me that they were not pulling the product and there was no intention of no longer supplying it and that the shelves are just empty because they're they're just struggling to you know to keep up okay so at the end of the day I so I, I had a little bit mixed feelings about who's telling the truth you know what ultimately I'll, I think I'll believe coca-cola right it, just a, a guy that works uh, on just stocking shelves could likely be wrong as opposed to somebody that's kind of what they do um, anyway so uh, I can't wait for that to come back hopefully it does uh, for now I'll, uh, I'll have to find something different so I'll, I guess I'll, I'll find some time to go shopping for something else that's that's equally as good maybe or see the, the, the problem I have is uh, because the taste is so good and it gives me 30 grams of protein for only 150 calories uh, usually products like that it, the bottles are very small it's like a little 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 container as opposed to this one, it was a big one. So I actually felt satisfied. I had I could drink a lot of it. Um, so that's what I'm looking for. So I don't know if you guys have any suggestions, something that actually we have here in Canada. I know there's people from all around the world. Um, so we may not have the same products, but anyway, we'll go, we'll, we'll go searching for something temporarily uh, until I can get this product back again. So that's it. Uh, I hope you guys have a great Tuesday. I hope you guys lose a lot of weight. Um, if you, uh, just let me know how you guys are doing. Maybe write me a little comment. How, how's it going? How much did you lose this week? Do you, do you weigh yourself once a week, once a day? And how are things going? Are you struggling with anything? Maybe we can hash it out. We can talk about it. Okay. All right. Thanks a lot. Bye guys.